Hey guys, I'm Johnny and welcome back to Johnny Plays Minecraft. This is episode 42 and oh my god, I've been doing so much off camera stuff and it's been so long since I've recorded an episode. Just wanted to apologize to you guys oh, so much, but we'll get more into that um, a bit later of where I've been and what's happening with the world here. Um, but today, we're going to be doing a little bit of stuff here, a little bit of stuff there, a little bit of stuff back over this way and all over the place. We've got lots to do today and 20 minutes to do it. <laughs> um, now we've got 20 minutes of video to do it, but we'll get as much as we done, can done today. And today I just kind of want to spend a little bit of time sprouting ideas of uh, what I want to do with the world here. Because like I said, I've been doing a lot off camera and I've tried recording this episode three or four times, but um, I just have not been too happy with what's been going on. Um, what's happening in here? We'll have to sort this out. 64, what's happened? Um, let me, um, I'll have to f sort out what's going on with the witch farm. <laughs> um, but what I've done, and it seems to have stuffed up, I'll have to get in the hoppers, but I've actually moved these all over one and removed the end chest so the end end layer there is now glass bottles i've moved them all over one and the redstone chest used to be in here um i've started with um putting chests here i'm going to do chests on all four walls and i'm going to be making in this area what i'm going to be calling the storage pit and i think that's kind of a cool name um but i can't really do too much on it just yet um because i need to collect a lot of iron um, also, Garfield the Cat, guys, I did record me naming this, this is thanks to Lord Monkey Cheese. Um, that's a great name for the, my little ginger cat here, I love it. So, little Garfield is hanging down here, he's keeping watch over this cave, making sure no creepers come in here. Um, actually that was unintentional, but that's what he's doing. Um, and he's just down here, I don't know how he got down here. Um, but he'll, he'll keep our area safe. Um, so in the storage room here, I've kind of, uh, got the design I'm going to go with. I'm just in the process of... Uh, starting to collect some iron up uh, and I'll show you guys the iron golem farm now because I have now got that completed um, The two slots that I have as you can see it is now working. Um, this is all temporary this storage here I just put this glass here to stop the items from jumping out because they were doing that um, But I've filled this up and I've started to collect a bit of iron here as you can see we're starting to get two stacks in now um, But I am thinking of just going afk overnight to maybe tonight and just leaving my computer on and letting this all store up because I need a lot of iron. I'm going to be building a lot of iron blocks around the place and I need to start hurrying up. Um, I'll show you some stuff on the surface. Disc farm stuff, um, I've come to the decision I need to do a lot of off camera work with that. I need to light up a lot more caves before this is going to be efficient enough to test. So we'll get back onto that later. Um, and in this way here, in this big hole, this is actually a slime chunk. So, I actually have a slime chunk right here, which is perfect if you ask me. Like, I could not have asked for a better location just to the end of this walkway. Boom, slime chunk. So, what we're going to be doing, going to be doing, sorry, is we're going to be hooking this up. I'm going to be making spawn pads and um, doing some different stuff down the bottom to kill them and whatnot. I think I need to dig this hole just three or so blocks larger on each side just to make some falling room. Um, we've got another cat here, still need two more names for them if you guys want to jump in and get the names happening. Um, but what we'll do is we'll just head up on the surface. I need to just show you guys what I've been doing today. Um, like I said, I, I've just been doing a lot, but it's been stuff that I can't really record. Um, so let's just get up the elevator here, hopefully it's not too loud. Um, but up the top here, I've been doing some work. As you can see, starting to put a third iron golem farm at the back there we're going to have another one at that side as well and i'm thinking maybe two more up the top on each of them as well um and maybe even two on this side we can make like so many of these around this area it's not even going to be funny so we may be doing that um i know i'm going to have at least eight of them working at once which should be good um but i've got the villagers breeding i've got 16 villagers in each of the two slots they're spawning iron golems over the far side and in this one this one's, as I said, of still hooking that up. Um, yeah, I've done some work with the disc farm, but nothing I can really show and explain right now. But let's head back down and we can start work on today's episode, which we're probably going to be working a bit on the storage pit today. Um, today, I just need to talk to you guys more than anything, because um, it's been so long since I have made a video. So, 
Well, what we're going to do is we're just going to leave all that there and we'll take these out and we can make 14 blocks and I can kind of show you guys the storage pit and what I want to do with this. So let me know as well guys what you want to see me do next. Um, I've kind of outlined it for you. So we've got storage pit is one thing. We've got um, the slime farm is another. And two more things here is a villager trade center but I think I might wait till 1.8 for that. And also a potion lab, which we're going to chuck in somewhere. We've got a lab. We've got our laboratory down here, but um, we need an actual potion lab down here too. As well, I've done the floor here. Tell me if you like that. I'm not too sure about it, but well, it's all right. It's doing, it's doing the job that it needs to do. Um, but where are we at? We're going to do the storage pit. Right, and I want to talk to you guys. So... As you may or, know, may or may not know, it's been about six days since I did the last video, put the last one up, or nearly a week now, and the I didn't really want to upload that episode. Um, I was really, I didn't really like it, uh, to be honest, uh, but the only reason I decided I was going to upload it was because I didn't know when this one was going to be coming out. I didn't know how long it was going to take for me to do the work I needed to do for this one. And as you can see, it's been another week and I'm still not fully prepared to make a video. I just am making this one as well to get a video out to you guys. So um, I do apologize uh, for the big gaps between them. And I do apologize for last episode being a little bit all over the place and a little bit boring. Um, but like I said, yeah, just needed... Didn't know when the next one was going to be, so I put it up anyway and just thought you guys would enjoy it or would not, and that was fine. Um, but one thing I kind of wanted to ask you guys uh, for this episode is if you could please get behind the likes and stuff this episode. It really mean a lot to me because um, they've been dropping off a lot lately, but I know that's probably because I haven't been doing as much good stuff in videos. Um, but I'm going to try and pick things back up again as best as I can and uh, we'll get some good work done. We might start with this this wall here, I think, next. Um, and I'll, I'll explain this storage pit a bit more in a second. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna try and pick the videos back up and make them a little bit more interesting. I'm starting to get a few ideas about what I wanna do in this place uh, and a few designs I wanna go with. Now, I don't want the whole place to just be iron blocks all over the place. I'm trying to incorporate some stone slabs because they're nice and polished as well. Um, and I'm Got to try and think of some other blocks to try and incorporate because, um, to be honest, all iron blocks are all over the place is going to look absolutely horrible and um, I don't want to have to do that. So we'll, we'll come up with something for sure. Um, and if you guys have any potion, like, uh, not potion lab, but lab designs, like high tech uh, facility, that's the word I'm looking for. If you have any like designs for something cool like that, be sure to like take some screenshots, send them to me on Twitter, uh, make a video response if you really want and leave it in the, do they even still do video responses anymore on YouTube? I don't even know, but if they do, be sure you can do that as well. Um, and I will see it at some stage. Which one's the trap chest? Um, they don't tell us by getting inside. That one looks regular. That one looks red. So this one here is the regular ones. There we go. Um, but yeah, so if you guys have any like cool designs or just even some ideas, always just let me know in the comments as well. Because um, I'm a little bit stumped with it, to be honest. Um, I'm not 100% sure exactly what I want to do. Uh, that looks like a red one. And that looks, no, that looks red there. So this one must be the regular one. Um, so yeah, I've got to try and think up some cool designs for it and that kind of thing, but I'll get on to that at some stage. Um, what else is kind of happening at the moment? Um, yeah, I just kind of wanted to talk a little bit today about videos and why I haven't make, been making them. So yeah, I haven't really had all too much to do in my world here. Um, to be honest, I've been doing a lot of like maintenance, like getting the iron golem farm set up. That's taken so long. Um, just digging out the slime farm, trying to work out little things that are happening with the uh, disc farm up there, lighting up caves, going caving, and just general stuff like this. And I haven't really um, done any recording because I don't know, I haven't really known what to record that would be interesting enough for you guys to want to watch because let's be honest, you don't want to see me dig out a slime farm. That's pretty boring to watch. I wouldn't even watch that myself if like someone I really liked watching was doing it because it's just boring. It's just digging out a big hole. Um, setting up an iron golem farm, I've done that so many times in this series before and I just didn't want to do that either. Um, so it's, yeah, it's kind of just been, I have not had a lot to do and partly as well, I've been super busy lately. Um, 
like I've been working nearly every day and like it's not really an excuse or anything but like it's just something I haven't fully like incorporated I guess into a schedule yet like getting into routine of going to work all the time uh seven should do for now do we have any more iron down here uh we have seven let's chuck that in a furnace um this top one this top one there we go let's just chuck that in there um so yeah I've just uh because before, let me let you guys in on something. Um, before, uh, kind of, I had a job. I spent a lot of time not doing too much. Um, let's go like that. Um, I had a lot of free time to kind of work on videos and stuff. And since I've kind of had a job, all my free time has gone into working and trying to get myself some money and that kind of thing. And it's taken a lot of time out of the time I used to be able to spend to do things like setting up iron golem farms, going caving. Um, that's what I used to spend a lot of my time doing, whereas I don't have that time anymore. So that's that's where a lot of, yeah, a lot of my time has been going, I guess, lately. And um, let's just get five, eight, no, 10, that'll do. Um, that's, yeah, it's just, I've, it's cut down my time, I guess, a lot more than anything else. And it's just something I've got to get used to more than anything else. Um, so I don't like, I, cause I don't like going many days without making videos if I can help it. Um, I don't, yeah, I don't like doing that. So what I'm trying to say here is, uh, let's go like that too. Um, is yeah, I'm just sorry. And I'm thinking about cutting my schedule back a little bit because school's about to go back as well. And I only th see things getting busier, um, from here on out, for, at least for a little bit until I get used to things. Um, so I'm thinking about cutting it back to maybe two videos a week, and I know a lot of people are probably not going to be too happy about that. And I know you guys want to see videos nearly every day. If I could do that, um, I would be more than happy to, but yeah, I just can't, I guess. And I just wanted to say that more than anything. And, um, yeah, just, I wanted to let, yeah, I want to cut my videos back to two a week. I'm going to try and do at least one episode of my single player a week and one infinity episode a week if I can. That would be really good. I think that's what I'm going to aim for. If I can do more, that would be awesome. And I'm going to try and do everything I can to potentially do more. Um, but like I said, I want to try and do at least two at minimum, um, would be really good for me, I think. So let me make a few more of those though. Uh, which one's the sticks? This one here. One, two, three, four. There we go. Um, so yeah, that's that's kind of my plan at the moment. Like I said, today's video is a bit more of a talk one. I've got to spend more time caving, more time setting up things and getting things prepared and think of ideas for what I want to do for these videos because at the moment I'm not too sure. And I'm, like I said, I'm just kind of, I can't really do any design work because I'm just waiting for iron blocks to kind of come in and it's such a slow process. Um, cause like every time one comes in, oh, I have, was putting them in there. I think I put one in, in another one somewhere here. Let me go check. Um, yeah, I'm like waiting and every time I get nine, I'm like using it up straight away. So, um, I need to try and just, yeah, spend a bit of time and try and save some iron up if I can. I placed one on the side here before guys. I think I'm just trying to find out if I did. Maybe I didn't. Maybe I'm imagining things. Where did that other one go though? Did it fall down here? I don't even know. Anyway, um, yeah, so two videos a week. Um, I'm busy. What else have I had to talk to you guys about today? Try and keep the support up. Um, after this video, try my best to, there's that one there, to try and keep these videos as interesting as possible and do as much as possible per video as well. So like doing something that's actually interesting rather than making a storage room because you guys don't want to see that. Um, although this storage room is a little bit unique, um, it's going to have multiple levels. So what I'm thinking as well, because I didn't really uh, let you guys know this, give you full details. Um, this is going to be like the witch storage here. On this side is going to be iron storage. Um, of course, there's going to be a lot of that. This one will probably be slime storage. Over this side, maybe potion storage. We put the potion lab behind there. And then underneath, we're going to have another layer. And that'll probably be like miscellaneous items and stuff um, as well. The great thing about this, because I'm making a vertical storage room, um, if, for example, the witch farm starts to overflow with items, we just chuck another row of items down here and we continue it on. Or we turn the witch farm off, of course. But 
you know, that works as well. So I think it's really good to have the option of making it vertical and like I've got several blocks I can go down as well, which makes things really good. Um, so that's my idea with a storage room. That's why I wanted to call it the storage pit as well, because it's like the, uh, it's like a pit and it's got to have storage. So pretty self-explanatory. Um, let me just grab some of these out. Uh, something's happened with this, um, with this farm as well, by the way. I'm not, as you saw at the start, I'm not exactly sure what happened. Uh, there's probably a block of cobblestones dropped into a wrong place and now it's not sorting properly. So I'll have to figure all that out. Um, off camera, but we chuck these items into here and we can kind of start to get them displayed. I've really wanted to have chests with item frames like this for ages and I've wanted to, like with this witch farm, I've wanted to have these these all with item frames on them, so it's good now to actually have them all set up. Um, where is the glowstone? Um, also, we're st as you can see, we're all starting to get a stack of items in here. Like, look how much glowstone we've got, look how much sugar. Oh, crapper. Um, we've got tons of sticks and tons of glass bottles. They drop them the most, and it's just really awesome to have all this overload of iron. I mean, of items. Um, and that reminds me of something I really need to bring up, and something we're going to have to uh, tweak with our iron golem farm, actually, is the fact that in 1.8, when that comes out, they're actually uh, kind of tweaking the way iron golems work, I guess. Um, so iron golems aren't going to drop iron anymore when they die. Um, what's going to happen is they only drop iron if you actually kill them yourself, like player kills. Um, so lava like this won't work anymore. Um, so this will all break, pretty much, is what I'm trying to say. So what we're going to be doing is we're going to have iron golems fall down here. And because we just have this excessive amount of gunpowder, we're going to be using TNT. Um, and as long as I light the TNT myself, that still counts as the player killing it um, when the TNT goes off, so that will work. So what we're going to do is we're just going to store a bunch of them here, and then every now and again I come in, drop a TNT on them, go boom, drop another one, and then boom, and they're dead, and then we can collect the iron that way. So it won't be automatic, but it will all still work pretty much the same, but I thought I should mention that anyway. Um, so imagine if we had all that full iron or iron blocks. That would be so be so happy. <laughs> um, I need all the iron for hoppers and stuff to go in behind them. Um, but if I just tear the floor up here for a second, just so I can show you guys the kind of design I'm going with with the storage pit as well, um, I can do that. So let me just take them blocks out that I should do. Um, so there should be iron blocks going along the top of here and at the back of here too. Oh, didn't mean to fall into that. That is in the wrong place. Did I bring this up one? I must have. What? I'm so confused now. These iron, uh, these iron blocks are in the wrong place. What's happened here, guys? I've removed a line of hoppers, I think is what happened. Have I? I must have removed some hoppers. Okay, that's probably why my storage room, storage unit here is not working completely. Um, yeah, that makes a lot of sense. Alright, so where have my hoppers disappeared to? Um, I put this extra storage here as well, so if we get anything other mobs in there, um, that's where they'll go. Let me try and find out where these hoppers have gone. Have they gone into... Where have they gone? Let me take that out. Um, have they gone into, like, this here? Or have I taken them somewhere? Or maybe that's what these hoppers in here are for. Where I got these from. I just remember these were in here. Oh, I'm so confused, guys. Why has this happened? Um, I had these hoppers for something, I'm not sure exactly. So, let me just put these along here, because I don't know why I broke them down. But that should all start working now, maybe. Um, we may have to, uh, break this all. Uh, sort it all out, Let's fix up the storage. Um, where have we got here? So this one, here, should have... Let's take all this out. The glowstone's gonna run in. Let me just take all that out. Let's go, like, one, like, wait! It's not, uh it's not locked anymore, or something. I don't know, I'll work that out off camera, I'll get that all fixed. Um, <laughs> but, yeah, I don't know, guys, I think I'm gonna wrap things up here. Just wanted to make this video today to say sorry for no videos. Um, gonna cut it back a little bit to try and make the videos a little bit more interesting and give myself a little bit more time to work on them, and try and do something more exciting next episode, and that's what I wanted to say. Um, 
I'm really sorry, <laughs> once again, I just do apologize a lot because I am really sorry. Um, but like I said, gonna try and pick things up from here and take the world, kickstart, kickstart the world, really. Start this base kind of hanging out and getting things working here because at the moment I'm nearly dead. Um, it's not really, it's just a big jumbled mess at the moment. I want to sort this base out. Um, it's starting very slowly to work itself out, but a bit more work and we'll get there. So once again, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you did happen to enjoy, please be sure to hit that like button. It really helps me out and it really means a lot to see the likes um, and the support for her video. So yeah, and also let me know in the comments um, if you've missed the series and you're all good with the changes and any ideas you have for a scientific laboratory, high tech, I don't know, <laughs> thing happening in here, let me know. And yeah, apart from that guys, once again, I'm sorry. Thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye!